Today, we are going to be writing the formula for the ionic compound aluminum chloride. So let's see where these two elements are located on the periodic table, and then we'll take it from there. So let's start with aluminum. I'm going to scan the periodic table to see where aluminum is, and aluminum is right here, right? Aluminum is a post-transitional metal, but it's labeled as Al, right? Al for aluminum. And it's in this group, and this group generally has the, the charge of being a plus three. And in this case, aluminum does follow that charge. So I'm going to write down that aluminum is a plus three charge. And now I go to the next. I got chloride. I see that it's an IDE ending. So chances are it is going to be a nonmetal on the periodic table. I look for something that starts with chlor, right? And I see that I have chlorine. Chlorine is over here. Chlorine is represented by a Cl. And chlorine is a negative one charge. It's a halogen, right? And this group, they all share that common charge of being a negative one. So I'm going to write that Cl is a negative one. Now I have both components. So all we got to do is just take these charges and we crisscross them to just say how many of each we need. This plus three crisscrosses down, telling me that I need three chlorines. And this negative one crisscrosses down, telling me that I need one aluminum. When you do this crisscrossing, you could basically, you know, scribble out the charges. They're just used for that little trick. And we're focusing on the subscripts down at the bottom. So let's write our formula. We got aluminum. I only need one of them, so I don't have to write this one. But when I do write the chlorine, I need three of them. So I have to write that three. And now I am done. So aluminum chloride is just AlCl3. Thank you so much for viewing the video. I really hope this helped. Let me know in the comments. Subscribe. That will help us out tremendously. We're almost at 15,000 subs, so that's pretty crazy. <laughs> it's crazy. I appreciate all of you. Thank you so much for coming here to this space. It's pretty awesome. And I hope you guys are learning a lot as well. I will see you in future lessons. Bye-bye.